Welcome to Breaking Wire. Please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for more updates. In late 2024, China stunned the world by unveiling the Chengdu J-36 stealth fighter, a leap beyond anything previously seen. No longer shrouded in secrecy, the J-36's reveal signaled that sixth-generation air dominance is now a reality, not a distant goal. Larger and more advanced than expected, the J-36 shattered Western assumptions and marked a new era in military aviation. Alongside the Shenyang J-50, it confirmed China's two-pronged approach to future air power, mirroring U.S. strategies. The J-36 isn't just an upgrade, it's a bold reimagining of what a fighter can be, blending long-range interception, deep strike, and naval capabilities. China is no longer content to follow, it's setting the pace, introducing concepts the US is still developing. The J-36 is more than hardware, it's a symbol of China's ambition to reshape global air combat. As we explore its features, it's clear, the J-36 is poised to redefine the balance of power in the skies. The Chengdu J-36 is China's first true sixth-generation fighter, built around network-centric warfare, AI, and unmatched flexibility. Its AI co-pilot manages complex tasks, electronic warfare, sensor fusion, and even autonomous maneuvers, freeing pilots to command the mission. Human-machine teaming is at the core, reducing workload and boosting effectiveness in contested airspace. Designed for optional manning, the J-36 can eventually operate fully autonomously, commanding swarms of unmanned drones deep behind enemy lines. Its advanced sensors and electronic warfare suite allow it to detect, track and blind adversaries before they even know it's there. The J-36 isn't just a fighter, it's a command hub, a force multiplier, and a formidable challenge to the status quo. This is the future of air combat, realized. The J-36's most revolutionary feature? Its ability to operate from aircraft carriers in extreme weather, something no other fighter can do. Engineered to land on pitching decks in 6-meter swells, it turns storms from a vulnerability into a strategic advantage. While other navies are grounded by typhoons, China's carriers can launch and recover J-36S, maintaining pressure and power projection. This all-weather capability fundamentally changes naval warfare in the Indo-Pacific, giving China an operational window its rivals lack. The J-36's AI-driven landing system reacts faster than any human, keeping the jet steady even as the deck heaves beneath it. This transforms dangerous conditions into opportunities for uncontested operations. With this single feature, the J-36 elevates China's carrier groups to a new level of strategic threat. In a crisis when others are sidelined by storms, China's J-36S will still be in the fight. The secret to the J-36's storm-defying carrier landings is its direct force control system, a leap from traditional flight controls. Instead of relying on slow, indirect surface movements, the DFC system makes thousands of micro-adjustments per second, guided by AI. It can shift altitude or move laterally without changing orientation, decoupling flight path from attitude for unmatched precision. This allows the J-36 to land safely in chaos and gives it extraordinary maneuverability in combat, dodging missiles or keeping sensors locked on targets while moving unpredictably. The DFC system adapts in real time, learning from conditions and responding faster than any pilot or conventional system. This isn't just a new control system, it's a revolution in how aircraft move and fight. The J-36 is a master of its own motion, rewriting the rules of aerial engagement. The J-36's tailless flying wing design isn't just striking, it's essential for stealth, especially against modern low-frequency radars. At 23 meters long and 54 tons, it's a heavyweight with a rare side-by-side two-seat cockpit for complex missions and crew coordination. Its triple-engine setup fed by three distinct air inlets delivers immense thrust and true supercruise, sustained supersonic flight without afterburners. This power and range are vital for Pacific operations, letting the J-36 project force far from home. Every curve is optimized for low observability and efficiency, with a large internal fuel load for extended missions. The J-36's design is a blend of stealth, power, and endurance, a predator built for dominance. It's the physical embodiment of China's drive for air superiority. The J-36's massive airframe houses three internal weapons bays, including a central bay for large standoff missiles or heavy bombs. This configuration lets it switch roles from air superiority to deep strike, without sacrificing stealth. It can carry a heavy load of air-to-air -air missiles or long-range strike weapons, and may even be sized for future hypersonic arms. 
The J-36 is both a heavy fighter and a tactical bomber, able to hit key targets across the Asia-Pacific and fight its way in and out. Its hybrid nature makes it unpredictable and dangerous, capable of executing complex missions without escorts. Whether intercepting threats, striking ships, or leading first-day attacks, the J-36 is a versatile tool for Chinese planners. It's a queen on the chessboard, one platform, many threats. The J-36's debut is a seismic shift, challenging decades of U.S. air and naval dominance in the Asia-Pacific. It's China's answer to the U.S. Next Generation Air Dominance Program, closing the technological gap faster than many expected. Paired with Fujian-class supercarriers, the J-36 can contest U.S. carrier groups, launching with full loads and operating in any weather. This forces the U.S. and allies to rethink their strategies and accelerate their own sixth-generation programs. The J-36's stealth, sensors, range and payload make legacy aircraft vulnerable and demand new countermeasures. Its arrival marks the end of uncontested American air supremacy and the dawn of a new, multipolar era of military competition. The J-36 is a symbol of shifting power, a technological and strategic challenge that will define air combat for decades. The beast is unleashed, and the skies will never be the same.